Hey guys, so I am loving this update so far, specifically the ability to group things. While this is also great for grinders, um, drills and stuff like that, I've, my personal favorite use is uh, wheels. Because now instead of having to either activate everything one by one or only using a few wheels when you want to use them for propulsion, you can now group them and adjust all of them at the same time. Uh, using a lot of wheels adds a lot of power, but also quite nice precision um, movement. Like before I would have to go at, say, 10 or 15 RPMs to even get this to move, but now I can move, I think I can set it to 0.5 RPM and still have it move. Uh, so a lot better precision for whatever application you want to use it for. Uh, more than precision, as I said, it also adds a lot of power. This ship weighs about 680 tons, and if I set this to minus 30, it will, will almost instantly accelerate without having deformation or anything of the wheels, even though the landing gear is off-center. And if I choose to Reverse, it'll be a second and it comes flying back. So a lot of power from a relatively small setup. Um, and the setup itself is rather simple but it's for demonstration purposes. So yeah, the grouping option is fantastic and I think we will see a lot of nice builds. I will t be attempting hopefully to make some of those nice builds myself, see what I come up with, but uh, yeah, have fun with them, and thank you for watching.